Hello everyone. In this video, I would like to introduce you to Cloud Application Integration Guides. A guide is a set of screens that prompts user to review, enter or confirm data. For example, a step might display account details or prompt the user to confirm the status of a sales call. Behind the scenes, steps interact with your application by extracting and storing data. Guides are extremely useful for call center automation, especially for enterprises that value customer satisfaction, efficiency, and 24 bar 7 availability. Such enterprises typically use CRM systems like Salesforce for managing customers and relationships. Call centers for such enterprises rely heavily on such CRM systems to understand their customers. They also want information available on their fingertips and available in real time without the need to logging into different applications and doing data migration. Cloud application integration guides have seamless linking with Salesforce. When you create a guide in cloud application integration, it is available within your Salesforce environment merely by a click. The call center employees will find this useful as they need not go outside the Salesforce environment and able to manage their call with customer most effectively. Today, we will look at an example where call center employee must decide whether the lead is worth pursuing or not. Usually, every enterprise has a process that can be perceived as a set of questions to answer before closing a lead and create follow-up tasks if any. Let's look at one such guide. I am logging into my cloud account and into application integration workspace. I am now navigating through projects and folders to the guide. We are now looking at a sample guide that does the same. This guide is applicable on a leads object in Salesforce and is expected to be run from the Salesforce lead. Applies to is a way to indicate that the input to this guide will also come from the lead that invokes this guide. There are a bunch of questions to go through before deciding on closing the lead and these questions are presented through screen steps. The user needs to check if he or she spoke with the prospect directly or not. If not, then check if the prospect responded to voice or email message. If yes, then create a follow-up task in Salesforce for this lead. and close the lead. Also change the lead status to closed as not converted. Now let's go over how to execute this guide. We will now log into the Salesforce account which we have used as a connection in guide we just saw. Let's look at this lead object. You will find your guide listed as a URL under Details tab. Mere click on this will start the guide and pass this lead object information to the guide. We will execute the same flow as we discussed earlier. These are presented as set of screens. In this execution, we perform two upgrades on the lead. First, we close the lead as not converted. And second, we create a follow-up task to call the customer. You just saw how easy it is to work with guides to drive efficiency in call center environment using Salesforce. Thank you.